Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborne survive worse. He is a cockroach. Mayor Osborne really lives here? I never see him. Yeah, that elevator goes straight to his penthouse. Pretty sure he's up there right now. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. How come Osborne never has to vacate his apartment for security sweeps? He's got some fancy new system installed in the back security room. No sweeps needed, they say. Plus, you know, he's the mayor. What a jerk. He's definitely lost my <sighs> Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. Because you run a cops are incompetent. Alarms every other minute. And where's your stun gun? Hello. Man, I know a few sable agents who would love to meet you. I, I swear I swear your way out of here. We're in charge. Okay, okay, I'm gone. Could really use a coffee. <sighs> Multi billion dollars. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. What was that? Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Status. Nothing to report. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. 
Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Stupid, useless button. Hmm. Guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. What is this thing? Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? The fat Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No false sound. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norma could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Here. <sighs> Forgot about this. The Osbournes have a coat of arms, and a motto, Pax in Bello, Peace in War. <sighs> Gotta remember that if I ever write a book about all of this. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, 
Hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? This is kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? was too slow to save you. It won't fail, Harry. I'm keeping his room exactly as it is, ready for when he gets back. The key is with you, Em. I know you keep it safe. Wait, Norman sent Harry away for treatment? I thought he went to Europe on his own. What were you hiding from us, Harry? What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Why 
didn't you tell us you were sick? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Control, status. Nothing to report. Clear. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Got a real mad scientist thing going on. Continuing sweep. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR twenty seven was developed to treat them. Devil's breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Osborne, GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. 
What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? Wow. Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Wow. So many records facilities. Oscorp's going all in on defense reasons. No. A records facility could be... Bravo, bravo, bravo. Dr. Michaels went to this Oscorp building, but there's no security detail. This can't be it. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. They created Lee. I, I have to get this. No! Who's there? Have a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running.
Standing down, Control. False alarm. We need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. Need to get. 
get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti serum. Easier to take these guys out if they're split up. off stealthily. You're in timeout. Spider-Man, leave now. My men will handle this. Sable? Lee wiped out the agents stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned, superhero. made good on her threat, but these guys aren't looking to team up. Tired of you harassing our agents, Spider-Man. This ends tonight. You guys think I took out... be on the same team. Demons and Sable are down. Time to follow me inside. Why are you so heavy? You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. mean we're good? You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Lee's out of control. Oh. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. Oh. Oh. friends. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. No way to go but down. Turn back, Spider-Man. This is me and Oswald. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. 
the accident. You sound as clinical as Osborne. My parents died because of me. Because of what Osborne did to me. You're more than your past. Don't let it control you. I tried so hard to make my parents proud, to honor their legacy. But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice. I won't let you do this, Martin. Lee's pain, his anger, it's fueling his power. sample. You, Martin! Don't let revenge win. Fight it! I know you 
can beat the demon, Mark! Beat the demon? I am the demon! This is the wrong way, Mark.
Otto? That look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? Hey. Hey. Where's Otto? Gone. I would not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. No. No hospital. Feast. I need to speak to your head doctor. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do my best. I'll need masks, uh, gloves, right. whatever you have to sterile. Thank you. you can thank me by not dying. Oh my god. He'll live, but he needs rest. Hey, take it easy. Where's me? They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> I don't know if I can beat him. Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger. That's not it. Maybe it's this one. No.
MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. There must be something at the lab I can use. <laughs> 